So what is this called? We call it Meaning it's a tick. 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 How does it get into the cow? Ibo lo lo mete kesa itu kanya. They enter the cows through so this grass here. Yeah. The grass. Mm. They will hide in the grass. They mm. have a thin one. Right. Mm. Okay. 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 In so called Ipoloniso, I do to know his hand and he knocked at Akim, a Pumri. At first, that's the traditional or whatever. They were burning fire, mm. then they keep on getting these ticks throwing the fire. Okay. But now they have adopted this smoke and whatever they have to spray with this signal. Uh, okay. Which of the two is better? The old method of burning or? Aji o karo kwa nana nara ya atio no ya nui. I went a very bubu achaka ni kwa budo do esai do to uchaketa kim. Now they have adopted this system. It is good because you can spray when you are very far from the cow. But the other one, you need to tie. When you tie it, when you tie not well, you will find that it will can it can even now. Meaning you're more comfortable with this uh, method of spraying. Yes. Okay. Is there a way you can stop the ticks from growing? Why, why, why did they spend time capturing the animal like that? To remove the animal. What, was, what was the reason? What were they controlling? Kesi <laughs> Be madang here on the But these days they tell them that the, the ticks bring sickness of the not of the spleen. <laughs> they affect the spleen. <laughs> so that's why they spray. Would you actually bring your own? I come to see madang. Do I share the case with you? Okay, cool. I see. 